This video will show you how to add languages to your keyboard through Chrome. In order to do that, when you're using your Google Chromebook, you're going to come down here and click on the time to open up a menu. Look for the settings icon here and click that. Once this menu opens, you will need to look to the left for the advanced menu options. Underneath advanced, you can find the languages and in input. Go ahead and click that. You'll notice up here, I currently have the English or US keyboard available, but I'm interested in adding more. So I'm gonna click here and click on the add languages icon to open up a menu of all possible languages. For this example, I'm gonna to scroll to Spanish and select this top one, Spanish Espanol, and click Add. Now you'll notice I have both languages listed here, but underneath on the input method, I only see the US keyboard. So I need to actually click on Manage Input Methods, scroll down to see Spanish, and check the box next to Spanish keyboard. Once I've done that, you can click the back arrow and now you'll notice that there are two languages listed here, English and Spanish. And under the input method, you'll see that the US keyboard is the one that's currently enabled. In addition to seeing it enabled here, if you look down by the time again, this US stands for the US keyboard. If I click over here on Spanish keyboard, the letters change to ES standing for Espanol or Spanish keyboard. So again, you can toggle between the two here. If your menu, your settings menu is not open, you can still access the keyboards by going back down to that bottom right corner, clicking on the current keyboard. This menu will open up and you'll notice there is a keyboard icon. If you don't see the keyboard icon, chances are it's because your menu has been minimized. So you can just click on this little arrow maximize your menu, find keyboard, click on that icon, and then select which keyboard you wanna use. So notice now I'm back on the Spanish keyboard. So again, I can just click there, find the keyboard, select US. There's also a keyboard shortcut if you don't want to um, click with your mouse on the different icons, you can simply press control and the space bar and it will toggle between the keyboards you have. So now I'm on Spanish and I'm going to press control space bar and it gets me right back to US. So the keyboard shortcut again is control space bar, control space bar, or you can always go here and select by the icon. Now, if you ever wanna remove any of the keyboards, you just repeat the process from adding. So you're gonna go back up to the settings. Again, select advanced, languages and input. And then once you select those languages, you could choose to remove one if you want to.